Hi there. Welcome to Pilates with Diane. Thanks for joining me today. If you find that you're spending a lot of time on your computer or on your phone and you find yourself in this kind of posture a lot, then this movement sequence is for you. So first thing I want you to do is stand up. Get out of that chair, come off that computer and stand up tall. So find a nice tall posture and if you can just imagine the crown of your head growing up towards the ceiling, your feet rooting down into the floor, the arms long by your sides, spine is tall. You're going to take a breath in here, exhale out of the mouth, ah. we're going to do that again. Take a breath in and exhale, ah. one more time. Breathe in, ah, great. Now make fists with your hands, keep your spine really tall, and we're gonna start with some shoulder rolls. So you're gonna lift the shoulders up, squeeze them back and down. Slowly moving the shoulders in the socket. As you do this, try to keep your spine and rib cage perfectly still. So your body stays steady and still as your shoulders move and you're not arching your back at all. So just moving them up, back and down. We'll do that a couple times, breathing in as you do that, breathing out. And let's switch direction. So squeeze the shoulders back, go up and forward. Go back, up and forward. Good. So move slowly. You might notice there's a difference from one shoulder to the other. That's totally normal. One more time like that. Uh, and let it go. Good. Then we're going to take our hands. You're going to interlace your fingers together and you're going to press through and forward. As you reach forward, draw your shoulders down, pull the belly in. Breathe in here. Breathe out, lower the arms. Just release the grip a little bit. We'll do that again. Spread your palms towards the floor and forward. Shoulders draw down, spine is tall, belly is in. Breathe in, stretch a little bit longer. Breathe out. Release and lower. One more time like that. Inhale, exhale, press through. Stay here, breathe in, stretch through the palms. Exhale, lower and release. We're gonna add on. So you're gonna do the same thing. Spread your palms, press through. As you press through, tuck the tail, drop the head, round the upper back a little bit. Breathe into that stretch. Exhale, build the spine up. Release the palms, bring them back up. Same thing. Flip down, press through as you tuck under like you're hollowing out your belly. Breathe in, exhale, build the spine, release. One more time like that. Flip the palms, press through, tuck under. Inhale, stay and stretch. You might wiggle a little bit side to side. And exhale, build the spine. Release the hands, super. So we're getting those fingers a nice little stretch if they've been on a computer for a while, super. Next one, we're gonna call it a jazz hands up and around. So jazz hands go up, exhale, spread them wide. Good. So inhale, reach, exhale, press apart. Keep the belly lifted, keep the spine tall. And just imagine each time the arms wave around to the side and go down, your spine gets a little bit taller. Inhale, reach, exhale. Again, inhale, reach, try to spread the fingers wide, exhale. Lovely, let's do it two more times. Breathe in, breathe out. 
Breathe in, breathe out. Did I say two or three? One last time, breathe in, breathe out. Good, this next one, we'll call it like a rainbow arc for the arm. So you're gonna reach your right arm up, follow it with your gaze and just reach it behind you and down by your side. So making a little circle. Reach the other arm up, inhale, Follow with your gaze as you gently twist your upper body. Good. Breathe in gently, lifting the chest as you take your gaze, following the palm. Slow breathe in. Exhale. Good. Couple more times, breathing in, spreading those fingers, reaching around. Good. Inhale. Exhale, once more in each direction. Inhale and exhale. Last time, inhale and exhale. Super, give those wrists a little bit of a shake. So the next one we're going to do, we call it kind of like a, a V to W. So you're gonna, again, spread the hands, making a big wide, um, v shape. As you exhale, make fists, draw the elbows in, draw the shoulders down, squeeze the shoulder blades together behind you, flexing through your arms. Breathe in, you reach, gaze up slightly, exhale, elbows in, belly in, shoulders down. So it's like you're stretching towards the ceiling, you're drawing the elbows back, so as if you're trying to pull your elbows into your back pockets, the shoulder blades will roll together on your back pocket. Inhale, reach. Make fists, exhale. Inhale, reach. Exhale. Again, inhale, reach. Exhale. Twice more. Inhale, reach. Exhale. Last time, inhale, reach. Exhale. Good. Let that go. Just find a little bit of a swing from side to side. So arms are loosely by your sides. You're kind of propelling your body around a little loose spiral. Let your head turn gently with the movement. Let's try that a couple more times. The arms are Kind of just loose with gravity, almost like ragdoll arms. Ah, oh, good. And then just slowly let that slow down. Come back to center. Super. Just a few more things we're going to try here. Take your arms by your sides. Lift your one arm up. So I'm lifting my left. You're going to reach and find a stretch through your side body. Inhale. And exhale, lift. Right arm comes up, inhale, stretch, breathe in, and lift. Might have got my breathing mixed up there. So let's inhale and exhale. Inhale, lift through center, and exhale. And if that's too many breaths, then just find the breath pattern that works for you. And as long as you're breathing and conscious of it, then that's great. Stretch, lift and return, lift and stretch, breathe in and lower. We're going to add on. So arm lifts, you side bend, reach that same leg out to the side a little bit. Draw it under you as you bring your arm down. So adding a little bit of balance, you stretch, you lean a little bit. You reach that leg out to the side, same leg, same arm, and everything comes under. Reach, stretch, maybe the leg floats a little bit off the floor, and bring it back. And again, reach, stretch, float the foot, just toying with the balance here. Again, you can keep your foot down, you don't have to lift it up, off. See what feels good for you right now. One more time. Reach, maybe lift it, bring it down and back. Good. 
So we're going to come to stop sign arms like this. Breathe in. As you exhale, make fists, bringing opposite elbow towards knee. Reach forward, inhale. Exhale, belly button to spine, elbow to knee. Reach forward, inhale. Exhale. Now you could be anywhere here, bringing the knee just a little, uh, the foot up just a little bit. You could bring the elbow right to touch the knee. Wherever you are is great. Breathe in, exhale. Breathe in, exhale. Breathe in, exhale. Breathe in, exhale. Imagine you're pressing the air forward, lifting the chest. Exhale, cross. Press the air forward, exhale, cross. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. One more time in each direction. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Good. I'm going to do another toying with the balance here. So this time, keeping a little softness in the knees, you're going to reach your arms forward. As you do, try to reach your right leg floated out behind you any amount. Exhale, bring everything back. Get tall. Other side. Reach your arms, find that balance, float the left leg out any amount. Exhale, bring it under you. Inhale, reach, stretch the arms forward. Exhale. And just try to find a nice um, flow with your breath and movement. Timing it to your pattern, your breathing pattern. Really nice, everybody. Breathe in. Exhale. Breathe in. Exhale. Once more, each side. Breathe in. Exhale. And again, inhale. I might have started with this side, so I'll do one more on my other leg. Inhale. Exhale. Awesome. Last thing we're going to do here today is something called a spine stretch forward or spinal roll down. Stand with the knees a little bit soft. Breathe in, find that tallest version of yourself. As you exhale, allow the head to fall forward. Start to round the spine, soften the knees quite a bit as your whole body rolls down. Let everything hang, maybe give a little jiggle to your arms, and then as you breathe out and in, start to build your spine back up. So pulling the belly in, feeling how the core helps to build the spine. The shoulders are just going to fall into place and your head comes up last. Kind of tricky to do. Breathe in, breathe out. We're going to let the head fall forward. Oh, make some sound if it feels good. Soften those knees. Oh, breathe as you get to the bottom. You might feel a nice stretch in your legs and your back and build the spine back up, bone by bone. Just envisioning those vertebrae stacking and growing your spine taller as you root into the floor. Inhale. Exhale. Rolling it down. Inhale, you can stay down here. If this feels good for you, hang out longer. Build the spine back up. Ah, head comes up last. Amazing. Thank you so much everyone for joining me today. There'll be more to come and just keep those bodies moving and free from any tension. See you next time.